obviously I'm not a beauty expert. This is just a super quick intro to let you guys know that today's video is me going through my lip cosmetics and separating them into piles of cruelty free and non cruelty free. Okay, so let's just get started. This uh, lip gloss is from Soap and Glory, who I believe to be cruelty free. Um, it's a really weird lip gloss actually, it makes your lips tingle, which is not unpleasant. Um, two lip crayons by number seven which I've already gone through in other videos. They sell in China and so are tested on animals. I've got quite a few different Nivea products here from a gift set I got at Christmas. Unfortunately, they are also tested on animals. Um, my Makeup Academy obsession continues with some lipsticks here, which is good and also a lip liner. And then I've got one Makeup Revolution lipstick, which again is not tested on animals. Vaseline, which is something that has pretty much been a staple in my collection for a long time, is tested on animals because it's owned by Unilever, which makes me sad. Um, this Max Factor lip tint, again, big brand. Tested on animals, sadly. W7 was one of those uh, companies that I'm not 100% certain of, so it needs to go in the maybe pile. And I've also got their lip coat, lip jacket stuff, which is meant to stop your lipstick from coming off. Which annoyingly I bought specifically for a video and I wish I hadn't bothered now. Um, this is a Model Co lipstick and I freaking love it came in a beauty box and I'm obsessed with it. They are completely cruelty free, which makes me very happy, especially because this gorgeous thing, Cherry Pop by Clinique, which I got free with a magazine, is sadly tested on animals, but I actually prefer the model coat one now, so I'm okay with that. Uh, a Dior lip gloss that I've had for about 25 million years and should probably be in the bin, sadly it is tested. And finally, just a clear lip gloss by Collection 2000. Now, I think Collection 2000 are cruelty free. Um, there's been a couple of conflicting reports as to whether or not they are, but I'm going to go with yes for now. And also, this is a really cute Barry M lipstick. Goes on green. Yeah, doing this with one hand is not easy. Goes on green and comes up on your lips nice and pink. Um, Barry M is something I'm going to have to start looking into a bit more because all of their products are cruelty free as well. Um, and then last but not least we have a whole bunch of lip balms. These are Swizzles flavours as you can see, those sweets um, from when we were kids. The company that makes them is called FB Beauty but so far I've had absolutely no luck in trying to find out whether or not these are cruelty free so they're gonna have to go in the maybe pile for now which doesn't leave me with that much stuff although to be fair it does leave me with the stuff I use most often so that's quite good anyway guys that's it for now